Oh. 28 and a half on the nose. About there. In the middle of the ground. Oh, flounder. Wait. Wait, I was so confused because, like, it just right. didn't fight like anything. <laughs> We didn't fight like anything until we got to the boat. We yeah. were like trying to pull a garbage can lid up off the bottom. Wait, we can keep that, right? Oh, yeah. Get your pit. <clears throat> no. no, it's a trail. That's a yes. non head shaking trail I've seen. Perfect. Staying low like that, too. Any sort on top of the mouth. Two pitches around it. Like. <laughs> I know. What? That was like breakfast. Hmm. Whoa. <laughs> that's cool. Oh. Oh! Now he's hiding. Now he's hiding. I always catch flounders. To me, flounder are the hardest. They're the best. Oh my best goodness. Eating. I love. Oh, he's, where is he? He's right here. I'm going to see if he'll spin into it. Just Perfect. Yeah. A lot of times if you put it underneath them, they'll spook and they'll run right into it. But if you try to mm -hmm. chase them with it. Can I take a picture of this guy? Yes, it's sir, you found it. Whichever one you want to. A 10 inch trout. And he squeezed that thing by the gills as hard as he could. You know, and I'm like, I'll get him, man. Yeah, I just don't want to kill him. Okay, Let's see what this guy is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Black tip age. Imagine it's a flounder. What is this? Nice bit. Oh, nice tree. Mm -hmm. Well, that's the biggest trout I caught. That's a pretty good one right there. That's a nice trout. And then all of a sudden we had them everywhere. They were awful. That's what happened to all like our quail population here. It's like they just 